This is VBS News, Biafra Broadcasting Service, Matthews of the Biafran people. Atemobio, yeah! Atemobio, yeah! Ibokwen, yeah! Ibokwen, yeah! Ibokwen zone, yeah! Efik me kamo, yeah! Emiedi, aizan, yeah! Aizan, yeah! Is okay, Nemia? Nsibiri, also known as Nsibiri or Obidi, is a simple indigenous inhabitants of the Afro. The tribes who use Nsibiri are the Efi, the Bibio, the Iboki, Yako, the Igbo people, and the Ejagan people. NCBD was transported to countries like Cuba and Haiti via Atlantic Slave, where it developed into an Afro runner. The origin of the word NCBD is not known. One theory traces the word to the Ekoi, Bantu languages, where it means cruel letters, reflecting the harsh laws of the secret societies, such as Ekbe. NCBD spread throughout the region over time and mixed with other cultures and art forms, such as the Igbo illigraphic design. 1909, J.K. McGregor, who collected NCBD symbols, claimed that NCBD was traditionally said to have been converted to the tribes of the Igbo people, which legend says were taught discreet by baboons. Ekoi people, also known as Ejagam, are an ethnic group in the extreme southeastern part of Nigeria. Within in the Bight of Biafra and extending eastwards, eastwards into southern Cameroon. A Bantu languages are spoken by many groups, including the Atam, Boki, Mbembe, Ufia, and Yako. The Ejagam are related to the Efik, Anang, Ibibio, and Igbo people of the old eastern region. This video segment introduces two of the main features of Ejagam culture. The first are secret societies which once controlled trade in the region. The second is an ancient and indigenous graphic writing system called Insibidi that appears on a variety of objects both to convey meaning and simply to decorate and beautify. Jagam people live in the region surrounding the Cross River in southeastern Nigeria and southwestern Cameroon in West Africa. In the past, the Cross River was an important means of transportation, allowing people to share cultural traditions such as masks and masquerades. Today, modern highways make movement even easier. Two of the main characteristics of a Jagam culture are ritual associations and a graphic writing system. In the past, the ritual associations enforced the law and were influential in controlling trade along the Cross River. Many of these associations were sold to neighboring peoples. People would pay for the rights to perform the masquerades and related songs and dances. Like ritual associations, the graphic writing system called Insibidi has spread to neighboring peoples in Africa and to their descendants in Cuba and the U.S. Insibidi is an indigenous African form of writing that may be more than 1,000 years old. It is used to record information, conceal knowledge, describe philosophy, and signify one's identity or status, and it also serves as decoration. Insibidi signs are presented in a variety of ways. Contemporary artists have even appropriated them into modern artworks displayed throughout the world. This skin-covered cap mask depicts a young woman. And while there are no such signs on the face of the headdress, the shape of the hairstyle may be interpreted as insibity. At important ritual occasions, young women are also decorated with insibity signs. By the human condition, the style is inspired by writing systems in Africa. Oh, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. 
continues to change. Having this huge space where I use, you know, my body and my energy with the intention that at the end of the day, somebody's gonna go up there and clean it up. To me, that exemplifies life itself. One day, in spite of all the things that we've done, we're all gonna expire. But something else is gonna occupy that space. <laughs> Yes, New Year's. Biafra Broadcasting Service. Mouthpiece of the Biafra At Yeah! At Yeah! Ibo Queen! Yeah! Ibo Queen! Yeah! Ibo Queen Zone! Yeah! Hey. Epic Me Kamo! Yeah! Hey. Amy hey. hey. Yeah! Aizan! Yeah! Aizan! Yeah! Izokenemia! Yeah. Yeah, yeah.